Hi everybody, it's Annette and this is just my haul from today when I went to Trader Joe's. I spent about $60 and I'll show you what I got in just a second. So the first thing I got was blueberry muffins. I've never had these but I like blueberry muffins so we'll see. Um, I also got these triple ginger snaps. I do like these and this big container lasts a really long time. Um, I also like their oatmeal cookies that come in the same kind of container. I went ahead and got two cans of beans and of just black beans and then a can of garbanzo beans and a can of kidney beans. Um, I'm probably gonna make like a bean salad with the three of the beans and then the other black beans is just for just for eating. I got these cookies. I've never had these before, but they look like something I would like, so I'll try these out. I got some plain tortilla chips. I do have some salsa here that I've been wanting to eat, and then maybe I can also eat them with the guacamole that I got. I do like these, I've had these before. And I got some nacho cheese tortilla chips. Um, they're kind of like Doritos, but not not as um, overpowering tasting. So just got these as a snack. I got um, a vegetable fried rice. I get this pretty much every time I go to Trader Joe's. It, it lasts and it's easy to eat with, with stuff. You can just pop it in the microwave for maybe a minute or two. I got two bell peppers. I got some um, cookie butter. I need to not buy this, but it's so good, but I never know what to put it on. So I just end up eating it, which is bad. I got this seasoning. I've never tried this, but um, it has everything that I would put in the seasoning in it. So We'll see. I don't know what I'm gonna put this on, but probably anything. I just got some plain lunch meat. Um, I have some wraps, so I'm probably gonna put this on, on a wrap to eat for lunch during the day. I have a chip problem, so I got some more, some more chips. These are just plain. I've never seen these at Trader Joe's before, but today I did go to a different Trader Joe's because the Trader Joe's closest to my house um, had a really long line, so I went to another one. They didn't have such a long line. I got some salmon burgers. Um, I had some of these from Kroger last week, and I still have two, but I just really like them. I used to get canned salmon all the time and dig for bones and try to make my own patties, and I just can't anymore because I don't have the energy, but it, it tastes the same to me. Same thing, I get um, these pretty much every time I go to Trader Joe's. They're just really good and they don't have, they don't have cheese or meat. So if you're having a day where you wanna be full but you don't wanna eat something that's maybe triggering, I recommend these. I just got some guacamole. I've never seen this particular guacamole before but uh, seems pretty, regular to me, I'll probably put it on something or just eat it with the chips that I got over there. These other potatoes that I get every time that I can't stop talking about, this bag really lasts um, and I get it pretty much every time I go. And then I saw these in someone else's video where they got these. So these are chicken cilantro mini wontons and these are shrimp um i like to get there's like some wontons i get from a farmer's market near here that i really like but i haven't gone there recently um to get them so maybe these will be like equivalent and i have i have some sauce that i normally put on them and i have some of it in the in the free in the refrigerator so i hope these are good i've never had these before i have no idea how much they cost 
because <laughs> I was at a different Trader Joe's. So everything here was about $60 and it should last me um, with the food that I already have in my kitchen. Bye.